Jerry's came to Better Piggy's rescue about August of 2019, I believe. He decided that he needed to get rid of him because too many people were pulling their horses out of the boarding facility due to the fly issue that Jerry was creating. Doing the only thing he knew could be done with the cow, we planned on sending him to slaughter. When the person from the dog rescue found that out, she uh, asked him if he could uh, be willing to surrender the cow. But anyway, he ended up getting castrated by our regular vet, and uh, the owner of the horse boarding facility ended up driving him here. And I'll never forget when that horse trailer first pulled in, how excited we were. We had signs up on his stall, welcome home, Jerry. We were up early to make sure that all the gates were open so that everybody could get here. They pull up, they back up to the stall, and as soon as they back up to the stall, I look into the trailer and there's this beast of an animal in there. Um, and seeing how big he was, it was just, it was extremely cool for me. Um, and it kind of started right then and there. So I, I took a little bit more, uh, it took a little bit more time to earn that trust and rapport with him and he doesn't really have that with anybody else. So for me, uh, Jerry really does mean a lot. Um, made me question my food choices right off the bat. Jerry, are you trying to eat my hat? Do you like my hat? Is that what this is? Oh, oh, oh it's the tongue. The tongue's coming. Oh, picking our nose today. I feel very um, in debt to him now for the amount of love that I feel he's given me and the life that he deserves and it makes me feel like it is my job to make sure that, that he is well taken care of and well loved from here because we've come so far from where we were at day one. And So shortly after coming here, being in that 20 by 20 stall, we realized that he really didn't have enough space. It was very clear that being that large of an animal in that small of a space wasn't really a, a high quality of life. Um, and I wanted to give something better for him. We wanted to give something better for him uh, so he could enjoy the rest of his life here. And so we decided that we wanted to create this turnout um, similar to what a, a horse turnout would be or a cattle turnout and connect it to the existing stall. So we figured out where we wanted to put it and kind of mapped out the size with some uh, help from our some of our friends that help us do some of the projects around here. Here we go, here we go, here we go. Woo. Yeah, you like it? Get it, Jerry. <laughs> what do you think, Jerry? Let's go, Bubba. Come on now, get in there. Go into your stall. It was, it was extremely rewarding with the amount of work that we put into the stall to see it actually um, come full circle with, uh, with how excited he was. Is Jerry your best friend? Jerry is definitely my best friend. He's my boy. That's my boy.